All right, guys, so we are reacting to another video. Uh, this is going to be the Loose Ends missions from Modern Warfare 2. Uh, you can watch our last video where we reacted to the No Russian mission. So now we're getting into more into the storyline of Modern Warfare. I gave my dad a little briefing of what the characters are, what their purpose is. Uh, so we get a little bit more information once we get into the mission. All right, let's get into it. Gentlemen, we've lost more than we ever dreamed, but we will recover. I've got a blank check, and we're going to use every cent of it killing Makarov. Despite what the world may say, we are not savages. We don't kill civilians. We use precision. There's an evil man hiding in these shadows, and we're going to bring him into the light. Once his face is revealed, we will write history, gentlemen. These are the last safe havens left on Earth for Makarov and his men. Sounds like we've got to be in two places at once. Impossible. Not for the 141. 50-50 chance to take out Makarov, eh? Captain Price, request permission to take the safe house for Roach. Granted. Soap and I will take the boneyard in Afghanistan. Very well. We will cut off all avenues of escape. This ends now. Strange. Could have sworn we ended this war yesterday. <laughs> Fly for some position. Strike team, go. Engage mechanism. So where are you going? Trying to right. get to the, the where safe house. Oh, where you might be hiding out. Go. Where are you? Uh, we're in Russia somewhere. And Captain Price and Soap, they're both at Afghanistan, mm. trying to figure out if he's there too. So we're both doing it at the same time. That guy was just sitting there on the steps and shoot at you while you came in? Well, no, I think he was going down the steps. Oh. Check the 
replacement for enemy activity. Breach and clear. Go. It wasn't up there. So we're going downstairs now. No, it does it automatically when you do the preaching thing. Oh. Roger that. Shepard, this is Ghost. No sign of Makarov. I repeat, no sign of Makarov. Captain Price, any luck in Afghanistan? Plenty. At least 50 hive guns here, but no sign of Makarov. And all those people there and the guy's not there? No, I guess not. Or the quality of the intel's about to change. This safe house is a bloody gold mine. Copy that. Ghost, have your team collect everything you can for operations playbook. Names, contacts, places, everything. We're already on it, sir. Makarov will have nowhere to run. That's the idea. I'm bringing up an extraction force ETA in five minutes. Get that intel. Shepard out. Roach, get on Makarov's computer and start the transfer. Ozo, you're on rear security. So now we're trying to get data from his computer. Get more information on where... He might have Task went to. This is Price, more of Makarov's Since he's not here. The so cover me. I'm going to slot that guy over there and use his radio to tap into their comms. Ghost, we're going inside him for a few minutes. Good luck out there in Russia. Price out. Roach, there's an armory in the basement. Better stock up where you can. Makarov's men are going to do whatever it takes to keep us from leaving with his intel. We need to protect the DSM until the transfer's done. Wants to get away with him. Yeah, but you're transferring it. You're not running away with it, are you? Or no? We are running away with it. I never thought. No. Who's left? I think it's just three guys. Or four. At most. Close the cover of the building until the data is complete. Oh. oh gosh, they're everywhere. <laughs> they got me. Yeah. 
barely made it. Thank you, Todd. All right. is that Shepard actually wanted the whole incident to happen, the no Russian thing. He wanted it to happen so that World War III would start and that he would become a war hero. That was his, that was his main goal. So we knew, if we knew the information that he got, then, well, then he would be exposed. So we were at loose ends to his whole master plan of becoming a war hero and everything like that. So what is, what is your thought after a player who has been with these characters and knows these characters who actually has been playing it longer and then comes to a point when they are doing all this stuff and then you just get depressing. betrayed. <laughs> Very depressing, but I guess that's it's like a movie. That's how they get you, you know? Some people cried when this happened. Yeah, I mean, that's it's pretty sad that you go through all that and at the end they just kill you, but... I guess that's how they, you know, I don't see why more people would, but would, what would motivate you to keep playing the game, knowing you're going to die at the end like that? Would you even want to play it again? Well, it's not the end of the, it's not at the end of the game. Actually, at the end of the game, you go after Shepard. Are you still alive? Your other, the other team that was doing the other mission, trying to find out Makarov in the other location, they survive, and then their mission is to get Shepard. But they're the only ones that know the truth. No one knows except this task force, the ones that he's killing. They're the only people who know that Shepard planned this so whole thing. So how are thing. they going to go after him if they don't know? Go after Shepard. Well, they're the only ones that do know, so it's just two of them. Two people going after Shepard, and they get him at the end. How do they know? They were in this right now? They're, they Shepherd's, were in another place. Shepard, at the other place, Shepard's men start attacking them. That's what he was saying. Don't trust Shepard. Don't trust Shepard, because they're being fired on by his team of people. Oh, they got away. Yeah. So that's what he was saying, but it was too late for us. Cause he already got us. <laughs> All right, guys. That was my dad's reaction. Hope you guys enjoyed. Peace.